Welcome back, everybody. It's time to play our weekly game called What's It Worth? We ask antiques expert Dr. Lori the value of three items chosen from the PTL mailbox. And this week is extra special because Dr. Lori has a surprise for us. She is going to let her tell us. Heather, I mean, come on. All right, Dr. Lori, you get to tell us the big news. What is it, Dr. Lori? The big news is Friday, I will be in studio with you, and then I'm going to be at the Fall Home Show with Selena. I'm so excited to come back to Pittsburgh. This is amazing. <laughs> we are so looking forward to this. Yeah, and you know what? The audiences, we've been, you know, there during the Home Show whenever you're there, and the audiences love you, Dr. Lori. Of it course. is so much fun to watch them. the interaction between you and everybody in the audience. I love them. I have so much fun. It's a great time. It's a wonderful show always. The Fall Home Show will be a lot of fun. So much to do, and I'm very excited always. And I appreciate Ron Smiley for not having it rain. Thank you. Yes, get <laughs> more go. people out there. Hey, let's get to our first item, and this was sent to us by Jim. It's a floor lamp. This is not just any floor lamp, folks. This is an Oscar Bruno Bash floor lamp. It's from the 1920s. It has its original finial, its original base. It's marked, it's 68 inches tall. It's got a nameplate on the bottom. He was a German designer who went to Cranbrook and uh, was part of a New York City design firm. This is a very hot shot lamp. Oh. And, and what's the base made of, did you say? Oak. It, it, <laughs> Cast metal, not oak. <laughs> it's cast metal. Very good, Heather. Yeah, cast metal. Um, I, I don't know. I don't know a, a pricey floor lamp. What that might it's, be? It's a pricey floor lamp. Let me. I, I'll give you the tremendous hint. I shouldn't give you. It's a pricey floor lamp. Okay. It's Jim's. I don't you know, know, what, know what he's that... gonna be as happy as I am to come to Pittsburgh. He will be as happy as I am to come to Pittsburgh when we reveal how much this thing is worth. <sighs> All right, I'm going big because you played Go it big. up big. I don't even and know. You know what? And, <laughs> did. and and something like that, like with the the base like that, I think it could be worth a lot. It's all about the base. Yeah. That was a song. <laughs> I've heard that. <laughs> okay. Six fifty. Oh, I didn't go that high. I went four hundred. What? Totally too low. I told you I'm happy to be in See? Pittsburgh, and I related it to how expensive this is going to be. I knew it. Do you want to guess again? Yes, hurry up. Okay, okay, okay go. I'm going 1400 Oh, I said 1200 $4,000. <gasps> no kidding. Dr. Lori, that no may be kidding. like the highest price thing that we've shared in a while. That this guy, this particular designer, very important, comes out of Cranbrook. It's the whole idea of the early 20th century design. Okay, let's wow. see if we can do better on the next one. Okay. I know okay. I told you. All right, we have a, yeah. a beer tray sent in by Kathy. The home of the Dubois Budweiser Beer, uh, the Dubois Brewing Company. And of course, other people who don't know, it's not Dubois, it's Dubois. <laughs> um, <laughs> Lith Lithograph tin beer tray, circa early 1900. It's in very good condition. The lithograph tin and the image is very, very nice of the brewery. Yeah. And so was this, this was a Budweiser brewery that was based in Dubois? Yes. Okay. Exactly. Yeah. Mm. And there's the image of it and the landscape and it's kind of it's a nice piece. I'm very impressed with how good how the the uh, the fineness of the conditions. Very good condition. Yeah. Um it okay. mass produced though. It looks like maybe a souvenir of some oh, yeah. kind. Yeah. Exactly, mm. honey. It's mass okay. produced, yeah. I like that you call I'm me all, honey. That's I'm cute. all warped what now you, because I don't you know. Are like, my honey. Well, no, that, you no, are no. my honey. I love you. you know. oh, oh, no, no, no. I don't mean that. I mean, just because the first item was valued at so much, like I, now I, I'm escalating the value of this, I think. I no, just, I was just calling Heather honey because Heather's my honey, you know. <laughs> oh, no. That's You're my great. honey too, Dave. Oh, you guys I know are that. Nice, you know. I love it. I said $45. I, I went mm -hmm. higher than that. I said $100. $45. My gosh. <laughs> Tied up. Oh, but Tied all up. right. And last, we have a table set in by Scott. So, Dr. Lori, tell us about this table. Oh. This table is a Samson card table from the early 1900s, and their advertisement, which is still on it, was this table could hold the weight of five men, and they'd show a picture of the table with five men standing on it. We don't this stand piece beside our windows. We stand on them. Sorry. 
That's a commercial. <laughs> yeah, Dr. Laura, that's a commercial in <laughs> Pittsburgh. You may not be familiar with that. But so this was very famous, and that ad was very famous too, with these guys yep. standing on the table. Yep. Mm. And it's in it's great not like shape. like your regular college you party. Also, <laughs> Sorry. You can also use it. You could, uh, in addition to beer runs and then the keg put it being on it, but you could use it, of course, as a fireplace screen too, because it has that image on it when you, hmm. when yeah. you hold well, it. Yeah, that the way. design on it is very cool. All right. Nice. Yeah. Okay. Uh. And sturdy. <laughs> so. I need to get off of TV soon. Uh, Six hundred dollars, <laughs> I said. <laughs> I, I did not go that high, uh, but Heather might be closer. I said three fifty. Two hundred and fifty dollars, but it's a nice table. It is a nice table. It is table. a nice table. Great items this time, Dr. Lori. As I know. always. I yeah. Know. I know. And we, right. can't, and we, we can't wait to see you in person. I can't wait to see you guys in person too. Okay, we'll see you Friday and don't forget the fall home show. I'll see you then. Bye. <laughs> Bye, Dr. Lori. And we want to say thank you to <laughs> everyone excited. for sending us your pictures. You can email yours to Dr. Lori at PCL at KDKA.com, and maybe yours will be chosen for a future episode with Dr. Lori.